Hey everybody, Greg here with Aspis Tactical, and I had a question uh, from a customer, um, or actually a fan of our Facebook page, that asked why we would want to stipple the side of the frame on my Glock 19. Um, and the, the short answer to that is, when my hands are wet or sweaty, uh, I had problems with my with my hands slipping on the side of the frame, and that just kind of provides extra grip. Uh, the second question to, to that was. Um, does it clear holsters well? And, and the answer is yes, it makes no difference at all. And I want to show you a close-up of it as well as uh, how it clears through uh, a Kydex holster that I carry every day and I'll let you know that we are dealing with a clear weapon. But if you can get in really close to that, you can see that the stippling doesn't stick out any further really than the slide lock does. So if the slide lock's not going to hang on anything, then the stippling really won't either. And uh, to give you an idea, this is one of the holsters. This is actually the holster I carry concealed every day uh, when I'm not in, on duty. And it slides right in. And the only thing that's uh, left uncovered is just a small little patch right here, which really uh, bothers me no more than the factory stippling does on the grip. I normally wear a t-shirt on underneath it anyway, so it's, it's never a problem. But... Um, it makes no difference um, at all in how well it comes in and out of the holsters and uh, it does provide some extra grip there when your hands are, are wet and sweaty. Um, it's the only place on the gun that I decided to do this. The rest of the gun I, uh, I like the, the factory finish on. I was really reluctant to do this um, and uh, just decided to do it out of necessity more than anything else. I really think it, it turned out pretty good. It, it didn't um, it wasn't as hard as I thought it was going to be. Um, if you guys want to try to do this, I would suggest trying maybe on a PMAG or something that you can afford to, uh, to mess up if you decide uh, to do it. Uh, also, um, if you can, try to find a... Most people use a soldering iron. I use a, I use a heat pin that I can adjust the temperature on, and I would highly suggest trying to find something that you can adjust the temperature on because the Glock frames are a little bit softer than a PMAG. Uh, when, you're, when you're stippling a PMAG, the, the plastic's a little bit harder. Um, but anyway, take it slow, draw it out with a pencil or, or a Sharpie, uh, exactly where you want it, and um, go to it. Do it a little bit at a time. But I uh, wanted to clarify a couple of things there as to uh, the reason why anybody would want to do it. And, um, and also, does it, uh, does it clear holsters? The, the answer to that is uh, clears holsters exactly as it would factory. Anyway, uh, thank you for watching and uh, you can follow us on YouTube and uh, also check out our Facebook page www.aspisfirearms.com. I'm sorry, that's the website or you can find us on Facebook at Aspis Tactical Solutions. Thank you very much. Have a great day.